To enhance the learning process and provide essential school tools for academic growth, the authorities of Isolo Local Council Development Area have distributed learning materials to pupils across the 14 primary schools in the LCDA ahead of a new academic session. School uniforms, socks, sandals, exercise books and other writing materials were doled out to no fewer than 7,000 pupils in the presence of political dignitaries, traditional rulers, community stalwarts and relevant stakeholders. Speaking at the epoch event, the council chairman Ola Shoju Adebayo said the support program aims to complement the efforts of the state government to make life meaningful for residents and ease the financial burden on parents. This undertaking of our administration is to primarily, primarily complement our ever dependable government, Mr. Babajide Kodushova Soroli, in his mission to make life more abundant for the good people of Lagos State. The program is also our own little way to help surmount the challenges faced by parents in meeting their obligations to their wards as a result of the economic reforms of the president. Additionally, he noted that the exercise demonstrates his administration's commitment to the prospects of the younger generation as he highlighted programs his administration has embarked on to invigorate the education sector. The distribution of free GC and camp forms to admission seekers in our council area, yearly bursary award to residents and indigenous of the solo that are schooling in public tertiary institution across the country. You have the bag, you have the center, you have the uniform, you have the writing material on the house rules, and what have you. This is our own way of making sure he supports the family in, in his own small way by reducing the educational burden on the parents. Wife of the Lagos State Governor Ibijoke Snowulu, who was represented by the wife of Commissioner for Information Fumi Omotosho, said the program was commendable and it will improve the welfare of primary school pupils and boost enrollment drive among out of school children. Education, as we know, is the cornerstone of development, the foundation of, upon which the society is built, and the key that unlocks boundless opportunities for our children and this means that deliberate actions must be taken to actualize the opportunities made possible through formal education. The academic and non-academic staff across the public primary schools were not left out as cash rewards of 1 million naira, 500,000 naira and 200,000 naira were presented to the best performing teacher, the best head teacher and the best non-teaching staff respectively. The chairman, Honorable Lassojul, has done so well, bringing all the pupils together, awarding the best teachers, the best uh, uh, non-teaching staff, the best uh, teacher, giving them kudos, giving them money, and giving the pupils back to school uh, equipment, that is materials. It is a very laudable project, it is a very nice one. I give him kudos, I give him 100%. I want to thank Almighty God, because I didn't expect that they will call me and they will award this, this, uh, this award today. I thank God and, uh, and I thank the chairman. chairman. What I notice is that maybe punctuality. They said that punctuality is the soul of business. I'm always be the first person to arrive in my school. It's a very laudable program. And if you make children happy, you will be happy too. And you can see the joy on the faces of the pupils. They were so happy. 
It's a very laudable program. I've never seen this kind since I got to Subeb. So I want to say a very big thank you to the executive chairman of this one, LCD. Dignitaries and educationists present at the event lauded the initiative, highlighting the impact it will have on the beneficiaries. It is commendable. I want to thank him. And this is one of the team's agenda of our dear leader, Mr. Selebu, the governor of our dear state. I want to assure people of Ocean in Solo, constituency two, comprising in Solo and Ejibo, that we shall continue to deliver. We shall continue to make them happy. And we shall continue to make our party too happy. Working in line with the team's agenda of Mr. Governor, promoting the government of Lagos State. That is our ultimate. I'm grateful for what he's doing today because there's nothing better than giving back to the community, especially when it affects the lives of children. So, you know, going back to school now, having these children ready to go, giving them school uniforms, giving them their mega backpacks, I think it's a fantastic thing. So I'm in full support of him and I'm very proud of what he has done today. We thank God that uh, today is a new, is a new memorable day for his solo. And it's a welcome program that we love. This will make all our children to know what they are doing. Most especially the, uh, the children. They will now know that the education is the best legacy. Ola Shoju Adebayo restated his commitment to ensuring teachers and pupils are highly supported and rewarded for display of excellence. You can see the woman that won the grand prize of one million crying because they believe reward of teachers are in heaven. But we as a council, we are saying no. You should be rewarded in, on earth. And you see that next year is going to be very competitive. Everybody wants to put in their best and our children will be the better for it. The supplies will enhance the students' enthusiasm for learning, thereby fostering academic excellence, while the rewards will motivate teaching and non-teaching staff to continue giving their best. Oh, Sherry, go be in my